Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Scorpio, February 21, 2023. You might learn valuable new things related to money or practical affairs now, or you understand your needs more fully. It's a good day for new insights into your income and practical matters. It can be a fine time to make something special from what you have and feel more accomplished. It's a better time than usual for addressing problems, even those that seem especially sensitive or complex, since many of the day's benefits come from your ability to understand and face truths. Others are putting their faith in you, and you in them. Business intuition is excellent, and practical affairs thrive with a little strategy. Your appreciation builds for simple pleasures and comforts, as well as for familiar people and circumstances. A spicy frequency is echoing through the atoms today. This is because sweet Venus, our goddess planet of love and beauty, is shivering through the depths of space and will link in a sextile to powerhouse Pluto in the heavens above. You will feel an overwhelming hunger for closeness and intimacy. However, depending on your innate sense of self-worth, you could feel overly emotional and triggered if your needs are not being met by your partner, lover, or family. Don't rock the boat just because you're feeling all over the place. Try to find a stable foundation within. Make a serious adjustment with your money. You have the financial power to turn a new leaf, so it might be time to do so when Venus in Pisces sextals Pluto in Capricorn. Pluto's financial position implies that you have incredible power over the outcome of what you pay for, so it might be time to use your money to revamp your workspace. You could purchase a few trinkets, decorations, and even furniture to make your work environment homier. Try not to go overboard, but do not forget to enjoy this financial freedom. Two days after the moon left your income sector your nose for money is still sharp and you will still be unpacking a download of information on both the income and job fronts. While that is the case with each monthly visit, as this is the first visit since the last of the faster planets moved through there is a lot more to process. Things don't normally feel this warm and fuzzy to you. It's an unusually emotional day, and you may feel especially appreciative of your friends. Share this feeling, but also include your needs. If possible, invite a friend to take a brisk walk with you and make a salad for the two of you to enjoy afterwards. Keep your energy in mind today and resist eating heavy foods or drinking alcohol. It's important to feel the love of your friends in the context of doing what's right for you. You will probably find yourself meeting someone new on this day. Further, you can also have an opportunity that you've never had before. This is something that happens often when this vibration is in the air and for you, this can be very good news. You love meeting new people and forming relationships. Just take care that you keep your wits about you and that you don't get swept away by emotion. It is in Venus' final hours in your home and family sector and during the sun's first full day here that the moon not only returns but as a new moon. Venus has spent the last 24 days making home where your heart is and working with Neptune to update your dreams, desires and expectations for the coming year, with the sun and moon staying on to take it from here. This frees Venus to move on, with her return to a fun, playful, romantic and creatively charged part of your chart set to have exciting implications over the coming weeks. Today brings you to what could be a game-changing point in the year for matters of the heart and all things romantic with Venus' early return to your romantic sector. Last year Venus didn't return until May, but she has not only arrived ahead of schedule but to find Jupiter here. It has been over a decade since the planets of love and luck were last in your romantic sector at the same time, together unleashing the full potential of what was always destined to be a lucky year for love. Our eyes in the sky. Tonight, a new moon in Pisces graces the sky, offering you an opportunity to start a fresh chapter in your love life. Whether you're single or in a relationship, this lunar event invites you to take bold and courageous steps towards romantic fulfillment. For those currently unattached, this is an auspicious time to put yourself out there and take a chance on love. If you've been crushing on someone, don't hesitate to ask them out on a date. 
Let go of any fears or doubts that may be holding you back and embrace the exciting possibilities that await. If you're already in a relationship, the new moon in Pisces invites you to reconnect with your partner on a deeper level. Plan a romantic evening together, perhaps a candlelit dinner under the starry sky. Use this time to express your love and affection for each other, and explore new ways to strengthen your bond. Remember that the energy of the new moon is all about setting intentions and starting fresh. Take some time tonight to reflect on what you truly desire when it comes to matters of the heart. Whether you're single or in a relationship, trust that the universe is supporting you in your quest for love and fulfillment. So go ahead and take that leap of faith towards the happiness you deserve. As we wake up to a new day, the cosmic energy of Venus in Pisces sextling Pluto in Capricorn brings a potent and transformative influence to our relationships. This celestial aspect ignites a fiery passion and intensity in our interactions, allowing us to deepen our connections and gain a better understanding of our partners. During this transit, there is no room for superficiality or small talk. Every gesture, every word carries a significant meaning, and we become acutely aware of the importance of nurturing our relationships. As we foster feelings of interconnectedness and unity, we can strengthen the bonds that tie us to our loved ones. Under the influence of this transit, we may experience a kind of rose-tinted tunnel vision, where our focus is solely on our significant other. We become captivated by their presence, and our devotion to them becomes all-encompassing. However, this doesn't mean that we should ignore our other commitments or responsibilities. We need to strike a balance and ensure that we do not neglect other areas of our lives. Additionally, this transit may inspire us to keep our romantic unions discreet or private, especially in the early stages of a relationship. By exercising discretion, we can establish a foundation of trust and fortify our bond. However, it's important to make sure that we're not hiding our relationship out of shame or fear, but rather as a conscious choice to protect and nurture the love that we share. As we navigate the energy of Venus sextal Pluto, let us embrace the transformative power of deep, meaningful relationships and cherish the love and connection that we share with our partners. As the evening sets in, the Aquarius moon comes into alignment with Saturn, bringing a sense of sobriety and discipline to our emotional landscape. During this transit, we may experience feelings of distance and detachment from our loved ones, making it difficult to reach out and connect. These emotions can be discouraging and isolating, but if we can embrace the maturity and discipline that Saturn represents, we can overcome the emotional hurdles and find a way to connect with others. This alignment encourages us to take a step back and assess our feelings with a sense of objectivity and rationality. It's a time to reflect on our relationships and consider how we can bridge the gap between ourselves and those we care about. As the moon enters a three-hour void period following this alignment, we are encouraged to embrace stillness and introspection. This is an ideal time to engage in self-care and personal reflection. We may find that this quiet moment offers clarity and insight into our emotional landscape, allowing us to gain a deeper understanding of our feelings and needs. Despite the challenges of this transit, it offers us an opportunity to cultivate emotional maturity and resilience. By embracing the discipline and stillness that Saturn and the Void Moon represent, we can navigate this emotional landscape with grace and self-awareness.